All right, Shalom. First and foremost, we give all praises to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh Shai, Bashim, Rakak, Wadash, double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, and peace and blessings to the whole collective Israel. And as you can see, the title is article, Cleansing by Fire. Hong Kong protesters set quarantine slated building alight as locals reject any coronavirus patients near them. All right. And, uh, you know, cleansing by fire. All right. And, uh, you know, as it says in First Thessalonians, the fifth chapter, there's no need that I write unto you, for ye yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night, you know, and how is the Lord returning? Okay, by fire. Okay, so how is he going to cleanse this, 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 this earth? Okay, by fire. Okay, the Lord said to himself, Yahweh said to himself, okay, you know, I've come to set fire on the earth. And what would I be if it not be already kindled? We're paraphrasing. All right. You know, this is, this is, this is, this is what has been promised by the Heavenly Father. All right. That this world, which we see now is preserved for fire. Okay. And then these, uh, these Moabites setting, uh, uh, protesters setting a, a quarantine slated building on fire. All right. You know, they're saying rejecting any coronavirus patients near them. Okay. What more they themselves? Okay. You know, what makes you clean? Okay. What makes you clean? Psalms, uh, Psalms 119. How shall a young man cleanse his way? By taking heed according to thy word. All right. So, you know, a simple, and, I, and that's the thing, you know, going into the the earth is defiled under the inhabitants thereof, which I'm going to get in Isaiah 24th chapter. You know, why is it why is it defiled? Because they don't keep the law, statutes, and commandments of Yahweh Bashmi Shai. Okay, something simple as this coronavirus could be prevented by following the dietary laws. Okay, you're not supposed to be eating bat. You're not supposed to be eating uh, cobras, you know, snakes. All right. You know, these pandemics are, 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 are started by um, these, these, these animals. All right. The swine. Okay. So on and so forth. You know, unlawful animals that people uh, fancy themselves to eat. Okay. And that's abominable. Okay, that's an abomination. You're not supposed to be touching these things. You're not supposed to be eating these things. And this is why you see why you're not supposed to touch these things or eat these things. Okay, the Lord said it plainly. You know, these are the dietary laws. Follow them. Eat this. Don't eat that. All right? <laughs> and this is what happens, okay, when, you know, they say that curiosity killed the cat. You want to find out for yourselves. This is what happens when you don't follow the laws and statutes and the commandments of the Abbasim Shai. Okay? And they want to set these people on fire because they have the coronavirus. They need to set themselves on fire. Because they're unclean, okay? They're unclean themselves, and don't worry, okay? The Lord's going to send a fire, okay? Behold that day uh, that shall burn as an oven, okay? Malachi, the fourth chapter, okay? By these what? These thermonuclear missiles, okay? And by the chariots, right? The Lord's coming by fire, okay? He's trying this word, this world by fire, okay? As he as he flooded the, the world that was, you know, by water, this time he's going to flood this, this world that it is now, by fire, okay. But here, read some of this uh, article, and then uh, get into it. Here, in a bizarre attack, mass protesters have thrown Molotov cocktails into the lobby of a building that Hong Kong authorities were planning to use to quarantine people in need of testing for deadly coronavirus. As of Sunday, a total of eight people in Hong Kong. All right, nigga, you know these numbers. You know it's it, it, it's. The way people are reacting, okay, the stories you hear that coming up, it's not adding up, all right? The, this, what's going on there is far worse than what, of course, the, the media is going to portray because they don't want you you, uh, you people here in, in so-called America to start bugging out, okay? You know, it's causing that chaos that's going on over there to come over here. But, you know, it's it's biblical prophecy that this place being so-called America, being Babylon the Great, is going to get far worse things that we see here popping up on the news around the world. Okay, because this this place again, this place is preserved for that ultimate judgment. Okay, so called America is gonna hit it the worst. Okay, you know you see these things going on in the world, and it's terrible, it's horrible. All right, so what more here in so called America? Okay, the the true cancer of this 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 world. Okay, being ran by the so called white man, being Esau Edom. Okay, that's what the Lord promised. Uh, what the, the house of Esau being stubble. Okay, you know going on, so on and so forth. Okay, you know because all the witchcraft. All the nasty, disgusting things that go on here on this earth, it has to be corrected, okay? It has to be cleansed, and these people are filthy, okay? And they're going to have to be cleansed, okay? Brought brought down to stubble, okay, by these thermonuclear missiles, all right? Uh, yeah, read, keep on reading. Uh, in Hong Kong, had been diagnosed with the disease originating 
from the mainland China city of Wuhan with three more patients added to the list. All right, there's people out here in America already dying of, of, of flu in California. OK, this stuff is getting serious here and you're going on to uh, back then when these these outbreaks broke out, they didn't have planes. OK, they didn't have massive farms producing millions of animals, so on and so forth daily. OK, you know, they didn't have, you know, the world wasn't as, wasn't as connected as it is today. OK, so disease like this are, are you know, going to this, this 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 earth being ripe for destruction. OK, ready and primed for destruction. OK, has all things in place for this place to go down. OK, you know, car didn't have cars back then. The place you, it would take you days to get you get there in half an hour. OK. You know, and, that, and that's and that's a, a prime recipe for these outbreaks. OK, because ultimately, again, if you don't have the spirit of the Lord on you in these times to come, you're not going to make it. OK, you know, the Lord talked about protecting us from these things that come in the Psalms 91st chapter. All right. By, you know, he'll protect us from the pestilence that walketh in darkness. OK, you know, because you can't see these things all right, with naked eye. Right. You even hardly see them with a microscope. All right. But these things are there and these things are corrupting people's bodies and destroying them. OK, because, again, their their food of their own way is is corruption. So they're going to go out by corruption. This virus corrupts their bodies to where they be put to death. OK, this is what you call a pestilence. OK. And this is just one of the things Lord has up his sleeve as far as the destruction of this world. OK, going into those four sword plagues, famine, uh, um, pestilence, the sword and uh, noisome beasts. OK, you read about that in Ezekiel. All right. So this is the Lord going into his arsenal, <laughs> his weaponry. OK. And that ultimate uh, plague being these thermonuclear missiles. OK. Which are going to bring fire upon this earth. OK. You know, here, uh, as I read it, with three more uh, patients added to the list, Hong Kong has declared a state of emergency. Yeah. A state of emergency over over three patients. Come on now. There's means and look. There's means and means of people in China. If not, there's billions. China has one of the largest populations of people in the world. It goes China, now India, all right? You know, going over there in that part of the world, okay? There's large majorities of people living in close quarters, all right? You know, and, and, and packed in households with multiple people living in there, okay? So they quarantine these cities, okay, for a reason because it's spread. All right, but it's not going to, you know, be the coronavirus or whatever else comes next. OK, it's going to get out of control. And remember, this is coming to so-called America. All that pride. It can't happen over here. Them Chinese, so on and so forth. You so-called Edomite, you so-called white men, women and children. You are the filth. You are the you are the prime reason of the filth on this earth. OK, that's why I just call you the board of wickedness. Under your rule, under the authority of the wicked, this is what's happening around the world because of you. Uh, ruling unjustly, okay, and not executing true judgment. Therefore, the Lord's investigating you, and ultimately, he's, he's beyond the investigation point. It, the judgment, okay, the Esau's judgment has been set from the foundation of the earth, from the from, you know, from the beginning of of everything. Okay, this man has been destined to be who he is today, being a wicked. Okay, and you other, you other nations that join hand in hand onto him. Hey, man, you're you're getting your piece of the of this the beginning of of your. Uh, now, that recompense, okay, what you've done unto the Lord's people, okay, so on and so forth, what you've done to his creation as a whole, you're being required, all right, and there's no going back from here, okay, <laughs> there's no, there's no going back, this, this show must go on, that's why I could just talk about this being the beginning of sorrows, all right, before I, you know, get into, start, you know, uh, because I don't want me to listen to, I always uh, I say that, you know, let me just make sure this time, all right, this is, um, Isaiah, Isaiah 24, and I started at the top. Behold, the Lord, Yahweh Shai, maketh the earth empty, and maketh it waste, and turneth it upside down, and scattereth abroad the inhabitants thereof. What are the people doing this in China? They're, they're, they're being scattered. They're trying to get out of here. They're trying to leave. They're trying to get from all the hell that's going on around in China. Okay, because before that was a protest. Okay, a lot of stuff's going on in China. Okay, but again, you know, America is not immune. All right. You know, these elites of, of this world, they're they're biting their teeth, OK, because they understand that this place is up next. All right. The economy is going to start collapsing and folding and people are going to start turning up against each other. All right. Coming up against the civil authority. All right. They understand these things. That's why this stuff is in place. OK. They practice and have simulations of martial law. OK. Of, of quarantines and so on and so forth because they prepare for this day. 
because they know this day is coming and this day, the time is now. Right, the day of the Lord is nigh at hand. Okay, and everybody on this earth, in this world is getting ready to be tried. Okay, and their work's going to be required of them, whether it be of good or whether it be of evil. All right, but here is verse two, and it shall be as with the people, so with the priest, as with the servant, so with the his master, as with the maid, so with her mistress, as with the buyer, so with the seller, as with the lender, so with the borrower. Excuse me, as with the taker of usury so with the giver of usury to him okay so pretty much no one is exempt okay if you're not covered by uh yah bashman shai okay in these last days you're not gonna make it all right you're, you're you're not okay you know and now's the time where you know get into the seriousness of the truth okay being 2020 a year of prophecy okay this is not a this is not a a, a, a um a time to take lightly okay at the least to say because this stuff's starting to tighten down, okay, and and this it's 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 uh it's time to make your mind you know focus your mind you know going into making keeping your eyes single, okay, not trying to find some type of way uh to fall back into the world, okay, because now is not the time, okay, yeah it might die down, but you know going into those birth pains, okay, it's gonna get worse and more rampant and more uh frequent, okay, these things are gonna happen around the world. OK, and you cannot carnally prepare for these things. You can only be spiritually prepared. And even us, you know, that's what you say. We prophesy in part, <laughs> you know, we're just we're just talk about us, us scarcely being saved. All right. Only only defense we have is Yah Bashman Shai and his word. OK, and that's what we bank on because there's nothing else. OK, it's always been about his word. OK, it's always been coming to pass. It always will come in. It's it's always about Yah Bashman Shai. OK, and we're trying to be those vessels fitted. Uh for honor of salvation to get out of this madness that's happening. People gonna start coughing, you know, fights breaking out. You coughed on me, you know, this shit like that. You know, going <laughs> the chaos is gonna be taken on around this world. Okay. And all it takes is one snap of a finger. <laughs> okay. These things are again prime this place is prime for destruction. Okay. You know, that people don't understand how 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 close we are to this place, uh all hell breaking loose. Okay. But here's verse three. The land shall be utterly emptied. And utterly spoiled for the Lord Yahweh has spoken this word exactly. So it's 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 happening. Okay, there's no longer uh, content. Not content. Um, you know, pretty much going back and forth. All right, this is what it is. This is what's happening. I right? either jump 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 on board, or you 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 go away, you go away and call on the gods that you have chosen. Okay, because this is not the time. All right, to be uh um. Like you lost my train of thought, but you know, pretty much just keep bouncing off the same point that now is the time. All right, this is this is the time. You know, maybe twenty twenty Lord's will, or twenty twenty one or twenty twenty two. But knowing that it's not going to get any better from here. All right, man, the Lord is nigh at hand. Okay, and he could, and he's here. He's in the funny things. He's been here the whole time. It's just playing out for his grand entrance. All right, this is verse four. The earth mourneth and fadeth away. The world languisheth and fadeth away. The haughty people of the earth do languish. The prideful ass Chinese Moabites, okay, the so-called Chinese being a Moabite, proud as hell. Okay, now look, you got a disease because you're eating bats. Okay, you you filthy, you're filthy animals over there. Okay, now that's that's why these things are happening to you over in that land. Okay, but this that's this just the things you do and have done in this life, the past your past life, so on and so forth. The things that you have done against the the children of Israel. Okay. You know, and, and because of your pride, pride is the beginning of pride is one depart away from his maker. Okay, you, you, you chink eyed, you know, Chinese, so called Chinese, the Lord has made you. Okay, so, you know, and in and, 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 and the time of, we're in now, okay, the Lord's judging you, okay, because of that, the way you have lived on this earth, okay, in your great ignorance, okay, but in, 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 going into Esau, even the so called white man, you're, you're next, okay. So-called America is next, okay? You can laugh with the Chinese, so-called so Chinese and what's going on around the world, but you're next, okay? This this place, so-called America, is next, all right? And it's just a matter of time. All right, this is verse 5. The earth also is defi defiled under the inhabitants of the roof. <laughs> Excited. Under the inhabitants of the roof, okay? It's defiled under the inhabitants. It didn't say because of, you know, the birds, the fish. They're, they're defiled because of the people who are in authority in this world, okay? Being a so-called white man on down, all right. That's what this place, this place is, is defiled. 
Okay, and it's going to show specifically why it's defiled. Okay, continue because they have transgressed the laws, changed the ordinance, broken the everlasting covenant. Okay, just first and foremost talking about uh, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. All right, and and the point is that you know now with the wicked authority, they can't keep the laws as the commandments because it was never given onto them. So the point is the Lord brought us low for us to see what happens when the wicked are in authority. Okay. Why these things are set in place for us to have these uh, the laws as the commandments that the Lord has, has given unto us, I right, being the children of Israel. What happens when we don't keep them? It doesn't just affect us; it affects the entire world. All right, just look what happens when we are not we are not in authority. Okay, the world is getting ready to perish. Okay, and I actually to say, if it wasn't for the elect's sake, no flesh should be saved. All right, so that goes into the importance of why the Lord set us up to where we we in the first place. Okay. You see, the other nations, they had their chance, okay, to, to, to hey, do, give your best shot. Let's see what happens when you, you, you're in authority. And look at the fruit of it. Look outside your window. Take a glimpse at the TV, what's going on around you, okay? And, 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 it's, and, it's, not, and it's not good, and it's going to get worse, okay? Because, here, you know, the, pretty much the Lord is spewing these people out, okay? Because, again, they're not profitable rulers, Okay, so here, really quick. Um, what was it? Leviticus, I think, twenty. It's a real quick precept here. Levit Leviticus twenty and twenty two. Ye shall therefore keep all my statutes and all my judgments and do them. Okay, talking to the children of Israel, that the land whither I bring you to dwell therein, uh, spew you not out. Okay, so the Lord, He said, keep. My law says commandments here, 23, and ye shall not walk in the manner manners of the nation, which I cast out before you, for they committed all these things, and therefore I abhor them. Right. So. This is what the Lord is telling us, OK. Here is 24, but I have said unto you, ye shall inherit their land and I will give it unto you to possess in a land that flow of milk and honey. I am the Lord, Yahweh, and your power, which have separated you from other people. Okay, again, going to these laws, and commandments. Why? What? What makes the difference between us and them? Okay, the Lord chose us, and He gave us His laws, and commandments, and His judgments to do. Okay, so that we can be as He is in that. Because again, this is how He runs. This is not. Um, that's what it says. As it is in heaven, so shall it be on uh, on the earth. Roughly paraphrasing. Okay. That's why Yahushua is going to come down. He's going to what? He's going to go into the 144,000. They're going to govern the world in righteousness by what? These laws, statutes, and commandments. Okay. What to do and what not to do. Okay. And the Lord, he abhors, you know, he does it. The Lord does not give any of these, uh, these, these Moabites and whoever else contracts this, this disease. Okay. Because ultimately it goes into the, the destruction of the heathen because two thirds of our own people, they're considered heathen. So they're going to catch the viruses like this too. Okay. Because why? Because. They deny Yah Bashmi Oshai and his law, sets of commandments and his judgments. Okay. So that's why the people of, of, of this earth is getting spewed out. Okay. And what who's going to be left? The just. Okay. The righteous being the elect, that new Jerusalem. Okay. The only 44,000 and the rest of the elect under Yah Bashmi Oshai. Okay. <laughs> but the Lord's kicking everybody out. <laughs> this land out by fire. Okay. And pretty much uh trouble, okay. Um here going back to this place being polluted, this is what the Lord says to you, talking to you, uh so called Negro that to you was Native American is Micah two and ten. Arise ye and depart, for this is not your rest, because it is polluted, it shall destroy you even with the sword destruction. Okay? Because this place is filthy. So the Lord is gonna he's he has to do something about this place, and he's gonna what? He's gonna clean this place up by fire. Okay, let me wrap this up because I kind of went a little bit, probably longer than I feel I should have went. But again, it's always about, you know, the edification of the elect I mean, the spirit of power. Yeah, I'm shy as well. That's what I'm doing. All right. So this is um Second Peter's, which we um, bring out a lot. Second Peter chapter three. And I'll start at verse five. I'll read a couple from here. Second Peter chapter three, verse five for this. They willingly are ignorant of, ignorant of that by the word of the Most High, the heavens were of old, 
and the earth standing out of the water and in the water, whereby the world that was, that then was being overflowed with water perished. Okay, and it's talking about the times, the time of Noah. Okay, and that's why the Lord, that's what could just say that the, uh, as the days of Noah shall be the coming, the coming of the Son of Man be. Okay, because this is great judgment. Okay, so what was going on in the times of Noah? All right, really quick. Okay, to get an understanding of why this is happening around this uh, around the world. It's Genesis chapter 6, verse 11. The earth also was corrupt before the Most High, and the earth was filled with violence. And the Most High looked upon the earth, and behold, it was corrupt. For all flesh had corrupted his way upon the earth. Exactly. This this place is backwards. Okay. Going into Job 9 24, the earth is given to hands of wicked. So this is what happens when wicked is in authority. It becomes corrupted. Okay. By by filth. Okay. Because they don't keep the law, statute, commandments of Yah Bashim Shai. They don't keep his words. The instruction book. The Bible. Okay. The Holy Scriptures. Okay. This is verse 13. And most I said unto Noah, the end of all flesh has come before me. For the earth is filled with violence. Through them, come on, and behold, I will destroy them uh, with the earth. Okay, so the Lord, so the Lord, nothing has changed. Okay, and going in, this is going into when uh, the Lord commanded Noah to make an ark. Okay, and this is what's happening right now the spiritual ark. All right, and we're going to get delivered by these, uh, with the world going to cause you will fall, being the chariots of Yah Bashem El Shai. Okay, that strangest, the strangest of our salvation. Okay, so far beyond that they looked for. Okay. Because all this stuff's going on, you know, Kobe Bryant passing and people, people, people feel it. OK, this is going to uh, Isaiah 47 chapter where they're not going to they can't put it off no more. OK, the day of the Lord is is nice and it's on upon all flesh. People know we're in the end time. That's why it's nothing else to do but talk about it. OK, prophets of doom, the apocalypse. People know when the last day is stuff popping up on people's recommendations, suggestions on YouTube. You know, the end of the world kind of stuff. Movies now, you know, go people watching uh, epidemic stuff's on netflix okay it's out there because the lord's warning you okay and these are seeds that are planted for the you know for the elect they say man what the hell's going on they're inquiring okay and they go the spirit of the lord leads them to the ones who have the answers that's the prophets okay of yah basham shai speaking of apostle on down all right so uh um going back second peter chapter three what was that um what was that? Second Peter three. Oh, I was at six. Yep. Whereby the world, the world that was, that then was being overflowed, water perished. This is verse seven. But the heavens and the earth, which are now by the same word, are kept in store, reserved unto fire against the day of judgment and perdition of ungodly men. So going back to this uh, article, you know, there's a fire for everybody. Okay. You can burn corn. The, the Lord's gonna clean up all this mess. Okay. You thinking about all these nasty things that are gonna come upon the earth? All this death, the blood. You know, the foul smells, okay, you know, so on and so forth. Okay, the Lord has to clean all this stuff. He's going to use it. He's going to do that by fire. Okay, the ultimate clean, cleansing agent. Okay, uh, that shall make them, what's that? Really quick. And I'll close out on this. Isaiah 47, you know, cause, whoops. Isaiah 47. Here, this is a beautiful chapter, okay, going into so-called America. All right, speaking specifically to the leaders of this world, okay, being Esau, even so-called white men, okay, Isaiah 47 and uh, verse 14, behold, they shall be as stubble, the fire shall burn them, they shall not deliver themselves from the power of the flame, there shall not be a coal to warm at, nor a fire to sit before, okay, because these thermonuclear missiles are going to destroy everything on this earth that's filthy, okay, that's unworthy, that's unholy, that's ungodly, all right, and, and foul before the sight of Yah Bashim Roshai, okay, but unto you that fear the Lord, Okay, the Lord's gonna come with healing in his wings, okay, and deliver you and, and protect you in his times we're coming into. Okay, because hey, you're you are being set up to be the new rulers of the world to come, okay, in righteousness. All right, so that's a heavy that's a um that's a heavy lot. Okay, that's a great deal of responsibility. That's why the Lord is doing a lot of character building, all right, and putting us putting us through that spiritual fire so that in the times to come we're gonna shine, okay, being purified. Many shall be, you know, going to Daniel's twelfth chapter, okay, many shall be purified tried and made white if we paraphrasing okay but um the wicked shall do wickedly and none of the wicked shall understand but the wise shall understand okay we understand that the times we're in is is, is dire okay and it's been now more than ever it's time to make sure you're straight with the Al Bashim Shai because he's not gonna spare nobody besides his elect. 
All right, so our Lord's willingness be edifying. And as always, we want to give our praises to Yah, Bashim, Oshai, Bashim, Kakodash, double honors to the elders and apostles, great millstone, and peace and blessings to the whole effect of Israel. Shalom.